The spacecraft Juno is on a five-year mission to the planet Jupiter. Back in October, as it was sped up by a slingshot orbit around the Earth, many ham radio operators, in the style of the movie Contact, were able to have their messages received by the spacecraft. Hello CQ, CQ, CQ. Earth flyby is Juno's way of gaining some extra speed and changing direction so that its orbit can take it to Jupiter. We said, what if we actually sent something to Juno? I basically came up with the idea that we could send Morse code to Juno, enlist the support of amateur radio operators around the world. So the intent is to join amateur radio community together in a coordinated transmission from Earth to the Juno spacecraft as it flies by. The website would tell them, okay, key down now, then key up, transmit for 30 seconds. And that's how we would send a dit. Everybody knows Morse code is dit, 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 da, da. Well, it turns out to say hi to Juno, it takes four dits and space, and then two dits for the eye. I thought, wow, that's a neat thing to do, and they're gonna need a lot of people to pull this thing off. I said, I'm good to go. We're getting ready right now. Here we go. And now we are transmitting here. They could hear ham radio operators all over the world doing this, which was really remarkable. Everybody's doing this at the same time. Thousands and thousands of hams. With any luck, the Juno spacecraft will be able to listen and hear all these amateur radio transmissions. And so what we're doing now is we're looking at the data that's come down to see if we can put together that signal that says, hi, will it work? Who knows? have the audio from Juno. I'd love you to listen to it. This sounds very cool. actually worked and it hurt us. When you think about what it is, it was really, really amazing. How many times do you get to say hi to a spacecraft that's swinging by your planet? To be a part of it, that was very great. More than thinking about what it means to me, I think it's, it's just such a great thing that humankind has the ability to think beyond our own environment. It's the curiosity, it's the adventuring spirit, I think. The space program has given us. Hi Juno. Hi Juno. Hi Juno. Hi Juno. Hi Juno. Hi Juno. Goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> okay, take seventeen.